In previous versions, you had to update delineated catchments individually. Now, with the use of a selection set, a new command called update catchments allows you to update multiple catchments at the same time. In the data, what's happened is that this uh, catch basin has been selected. It's got a catchment that was created using catchment delineation when the catch basin was placed. This catch basin has now been moved. Therefore, the catchment delineation has been redone and the catchment area has been updated. Now, the problem is that the next catch basin downstream is the catchment area for it and this hasn't been updated. Now there's existing functionality to select a catch basin and click on update catchment for inlets and that will update the delineated catchment. Update catchments is going to update all of the delineated catchments. I can just use the command, let's just start the command, but it will also work on a selection set. So to demonstrate that, I'll go and open the catch basin table and I'll do select in drawing. And you can see the selection set of 18 items has been uh, created there. I'll close the flex tables. And now let's go back to the update catchments tool, click it. So there we go. That's the processing completed. I'll just select in free space to clear the selection set. And there's the updated catchment area.